Hello people, welcome to my channel Informatics. In the last video I have shown you how to run ACS tag calculations and today I'm going to show you how to analyze the output, some of the tricks, how to you know depict the output from the ACS tag calculation and hope you like it. And please like, comment, share and subscribe to my channel and comment below what would be the next video that you want, on which topic do you want uh, me to do uh, next tutorial please comment below thanks so let's get started so in the previous video i have run a csd calculations and here are the outputs that is produced from a single csd run and the most important file that you want to analyze is the out file which is uh, produced from a csd run and uh, the most important part of the siesta you know the out file the result file will be uh, this one uh, will be mostly concentrating on total energy free energy and uh, uh, also on the relaxed atomic coordinates etc and unit cell vectors etc there are so many uh, options that uh, is dependent on your specific choice what you want to analyze from a uh, DFT run and uh, uh, rather than analyzing opening the uh, out file and analyzing uh, manually I can show you one of the tool which is provided by uh, siesta util command uh, in the util folder you have this CML com and you have this ccvich um, tool which can convert the xml file produced from the siesta run to xhtml which you can open in an uh, in a web browser so i can i will show you how to do that so the command is ccvich bulk dot xml the file that has been produced by the siesta one and that's it press enter so there will be a file called bulk.xhtml you can see here and you if you open it it opens in a web browser uh, where you can see uh, the metadata uh, how the siesta one has been performed your input parameters and the initial system of your uh, uh, crystal structure and the body of the simulation how many steps it has taken for the, uh, to reach a convergence and this is your final system which we, you can get the, all the final energy total energy free energy etc and here is the final output structure uh, uh, that you can uh, directly analyze from here and here are some of the summary informations so this is one of the convenient way to convert a big calculation also to a web browser format that you can share it uh, and uh, uh, you don't have to bother about the space that is required uh, to send all the files in email also. So you can send this file and they can analyze the output from uh, uh, this uh, access table format. So the another way of uh, analyzing uh, the output is by using uh, Unix commands. So uh, this is your result.out file and you uh, need specific uh, uh, outputs to be you know analyzed such as uh, if you want uh, this final energy uh, column uh, to analyze from the output you don't have to open it manually rather you have to uh, use the grep command that I can that I'm going to show you so what would be the grep command is gr grep minus a how many lines a means after so how many lines do you need from that uh, particular uh, string suppose you need 10 lines and you paste the string that you want to analyze 
within the double quotes and your file here it is you get the same output as here like in here you can see the output final energy band structure kinetic etc so so suppose if you need this cell volume column then what you can do is just paste that cell volume thing and you want only one line after that so the final cell volume will be this one and these are the cell volumes that has been I think calculated from every CG run and this is your final uh, volume that you obtain from a converged calculations so like that uh, if you uh, make a uh, you know executable file and uh, run it like this so you can get uh, all the outputs in a one go suppose I have created this file and uh, to create a uh, Unix SH file you have to put this command hash exclamation mark bin and bash and uh, all your uh, strings all your commands to analyze the output so I'm going to run this and then you can see how uh, the outputs uh, come over here so I can show you that. Yeah, but this is the file so after writing in a Unix commands what you have to do is you want it to be executable so plus X siesta out dot sh so what you can do is siesta out dot ss result dot audio file name and yes you get all the outputs from here like the final energy I need I need the stress tensors I need the cell volume I need the number of atoms like what I have been specified in the output file in the input file sorry so it's like number of atoms here you get the number of atoms you get final energy final energy block of lattice vectors yes block of lattice vectors and cell volume the final cell volume so this is the way to analyze each and every output very more conveniently without opening the result dot output manually and look into uh, each and every column that you want to analyze so this is the uh, this is one of the tricks I think you have many other tricks to you know analyze all the outputs but this is the way that I do and it is much more convenient for me so thank you Thank <laughs> you.